everyone, it is Crystal. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing a grocery haul and a meal plan. All of you seemed to really enjoy last week's video when I shared my double grocery haul, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it again today. So let me go ahead and show you what our meal plan is and then the haul. Today is Saturday. I'm going to go ahead and do the Sloppy Joe Tater Tot Casserole that I had planned for last week. I went to make it and realized I did not have one ingredient, so that will arrive today and we will make that tonight. So I'm actually excited to see how that works out. I have heard some good things from you all about that. Tomorrow is our big football day, so I'm probably just going to stick chili in the crock pot because the Vikings play right about dinner time, so I think that would be good to do like a crock pot meal. I'm going to try Kristen Casper's sausage pasta. She did a recipe video on it. I'll link it below. I've never tried it, but it looks really good. So we're going to give that a go. Although now that I'm thinking about it, there's one ingredient I'm going to have to go buy <laughs> that I removed from my cart thinking it was for something else. So that's a bummer, but oh well. So yes, that is Monday. Tuesday, I'm going to try roast. I'm actually doing a kind of a collaboration. I'm having a pressure cooker sent to me. So I'm gonna try my first recipe in it to be a roast. So that should be yummy. Teriyaki chicken on Wednesday. I also have a recipe video on that, so I can link that below. One of my favorites. We have it quite a bit, cause it's so good. And then Thursday goulash, because I have basically all those ingredients in my pantry. And then I left Friday open for now. We usually do eat out maybe pizza or something like that. So it's always nice to have at least one day kind of free or open that either we will eat out or have leftovers because we have some big meals here. I get all of my groceries delivered from Hy-Vee, which is one of our local grocery stores we have here. It's always free as long as I spend $100, which we are a family of six, I always spend $100. So yeah, they actually had some great sales going on this week, so I may even go back and pick up a few more items. Cereal was three for five dollars for some the name brand, the Kellogg's stuff basically in general. No, it was General Mills, I think. I don't remember, but it was three for five dollars. So I stocked up on cereal. Actually, it was all accidental. I put a bunch of cereal in my cart and forgot to remove a few. So we are totally stocked up on cereals, but you can see we got Fruit Loops, some Cheerios. I thought that one looked delicious. Um, I also really love Cinnamon Life. Fruit Loops with marshmallows. The kids love this, so that's a special treat. And Honey Nut Cheerios. A ton of milk, we go through whole milk, what is this? Skim for my husband and I, 2% for the older two. So we just got a good variety of milk there. And my favorite coffee creamer, I always get this. You guys know this. That is not a surprise. That's like a necessity every single week. We are basically completely out of butter. I wanted to get more, but it's so expensive. Hot dogs just for lunches for the kids. It's kind of all the kids will eat that. And it's just a quick, easy lunch. A few breads for sandwiches. The twins eat toast every morning. They get this 12 grain toast for breakfast every morning. Um, crescent rolls for the sloppy joe casserole dish that I'm gonna make tonight. This was the one thing I was missing. Um, cheddar cheese. I got some of this jello. I thought these would be a fun little surprise in Macy's school lunches and for Madden if he eats all his lunch. And then just some of this applesauce. They haven't been eating as much, so I only got one box this time. Some grapes, the boys love grapes. Yogurt raisins, all the kids love those. This is for my roast in the Instant Pot. Um, some, these are Madden's favorite granola bars, the Sun Belt. And let's see, vanilla wafers, one of my husband's favorites, and I think those were on sale. Goldfish, these were on sale, ended up being a dollar 75-ish, I think. So I got one, I think it was like a special three for something or other, but I only got one because we have a ton of fruit snacks from last week. Some cereal bars, I like to give these kind of a mid-morning snack for the kids. What else here? This is for the roast. Lots of crackers because we were out. Actually, these two are for Macy to bring to school. She's in charge of snack one day this week. She brought these one other time and they were a big hit. So, got those. Those are one of our favorites. I should have got three, but I didn't want to go too wild. Um, just Wheat Thins for snacking, Cheez Its for snacking. And then we have the goldfish. So, yeah, lots of good snacks there. Eggs were 49 cents for the sale. Fortunately, it was the limit one, so otherwise I would have probably got a few because we love eggs. Um, I grabbed some tortillas because we can do tacos sometime if we want. Um, chili seasoning for our chili we'll have. A lot of canned goods for a lot of the recipes. 
um, kidney beans, that kind of stuff, tomatoes, canned fruit. I got a ton of that because the produce selection is either way overpriced or it looks awful whenever I go to shop for it. So this has kind of been one of our go-tos when I'm out of my produce. Uh, yeah, so just a lot of random things. Picked up a few like macaroni and cheese options for the kids. Madden picked out the Trolls one this week. Soy sauce for teriyaki chicken, potatoes. The recipe I'm using for the roast said that it's good to use like whole potatoes so they don't get like mushy and soggy. So I went ahead and ordered those to try. Bow tie pasta for the sausage pasta. This is one of our favorite bread doughs. It's frozen and you just let it rise all day in your bread pan and bake it and it is so good. We love that. And then just a variety of frozen vegetables, broccoli, they were out, which is sad because that's what my kids love, but these are close seconds. So just got a random variety of frozen veggies, got some sausage for the sausage pasta. Here's our roast we'll be doing, a couple of pounds of hamburger, and then muffins were buy one, get one free. Otherwise I don't buy them because they're so expensive but they were $5.99 for basically eight muffins and they look so yummy. I can't remember if I showed you the apple slices, but these work so well so we can just easily grab them out and eat them. Shredded lettuce, we always get shredded lettuce for sandwiches and if we have tacos, we have the lettuce and that was on sale this week, so that we get every week. And then baby carrots for the roast and probably snacking as well. So yeah, I'll be trying the pressure cooker this week. I'll be vlogging that of course, so I'll let you know how that goes. But please let me know below. I went on Pinterest looking for a bunch of recipes to use it for that in the future. And I didn't really find like a ton. Like I'm looking for quick and easy stuff. So just let me know in the comments below if you have any favorite recipes to use in your Instant Pot or pressure cooker, whatever you use. Let me know below. Thanks for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.